Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial and today it's on More Vault. Now this is a really awesome plugin that you can download for free off of Spigot and it allows your players to store all of their items in virtual vaults. Now it has some really awesome features, so if we do the command for slash more vault like this, it will show us all of the commands. And for shorthand we can do for slash MVA uh, if you don't want to type the whole thing out. And what we can do, we can do MVA and then vault and this will show all of the vaults we have. So we have 36 available and as you can see I have customized the three at the beginning. Now you can change the name, you can change the contents, you can change the icon and if you left click you can open it and see what's inside. So inside vault 1 I have stored uh, various diamonds and if we hit escape we can go back to all of the other uh, vaults that are available and in number two we have some uh, golden apples and we've named it food and the third one is just lots of arrows um, so it's very easy to use what we're going to do is grab some random items um, for example I don't know emeralds maybe they're valuable you'd want to keep those hidden uh, so let's grab some of those and let's grab some redstone as well uh, there we go redstone pop some down like that so there we go so if we uh, repeat the command again and choose vault 4 uh, left click we can open it and pop in our items hit escape to go back and then we can right click to change the icon so we have all of these to choose from um, and as we put emeralds in we're going to use this one so click that and uh, it won't change because it's already an emerald uh, but if we middle click we can change the name so you can type in chat whatever you want to call it so we're going to call it emerald and there we go so we have arrows emerald vault 5 food and diamonds are forever um, so let's go into 5 this is going to be our redstone vault um, and then we are going to middle click change the name redstone if we can type it out correctly and right click to change the icon to redstone which is here and there we go so we have uh, five customized vaults now uh, the reason I really like this plugin is because you can um, keep a tab on where all your items are and you can uh, sort it out properly and make sure you know where everything is so we know where diamonds are we know where food is arrows emeralds and redstone so for admins you can do the command MVA vault and then a player's name and then an ID um, so you can check that they don't have anything they shouldn't have for example uh, maybe if they have a million diamonds you will think they might be cheating or something so you can obviously check that so here we are in the more vault folder and as you can see there is a single config file and if we open it up uh, there isn't too much in here we can edit the various messages we can change the law um, and we can change the titles in the GUI but the most important thing in here is the default icon as you remember uh, we actually created vault 4 as an emerald and uh, we couldn't tell the difference between that and the default one so you might want to change this to glass or stone or um, sponge or an item people don't really use uh, that would be the best thing to do and we can change the max vault size and um, 54 is the limit and the vault size um, once you actually get in a vault is 4 and then 6 is the maximum you can set it to so depending on how much storage you want players to have uh, you can change these two values and uh, how many you get by default without permission so uh, if you want to give donators more vaults that could be a nice way to get people to donate or higher ranks and admins can get more than one uh, but that is a great way to do it by having this permission more vault dot vault and then however many you want to give them so that is the plugin it's uh, it's free as I mentioned before it's fantastic and it's easy to use so subscribe like comment and I'll see you next time